Think about this for a moment. If millions of people worldwide say they claim Jesus as their Lord and Savior, then why did Jesus always warn how hard it will be to enter God's kingdom? This is a rhetorical question, of course. I know the answer. Jesus himself tells us. He said in Matthew 7, 21, Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but the one who does the will of my Father who is in heaven. But wait, don't all believers believe they're saved? Hmm, let's repeat the end of the last verse. But the one who does the will of my Father. Shalom Aleichem. I bring you peace in the native Hebrew language of my Lord and Savior, Yahshua HaMashiach, the one called Jesus Christ. In Matthew 7.14, we're warned again that the road to God's kingdom is narrow and few will find it. In Luke 13.24, Jesus again mentioned that narrow door. He said, Make every effort to enter through the narrow door, because many, I tell you, will try to enter and will not be able to. Ask yourself, what is the opposite of many? Yes, few. And when we look to an example of the seven churches in Revelation, we see our Father is not as pleased as most would believe. And why he keeps warning, few will make it. I'm not a teacher or a leader. I'm just a humble watchman using the gift that God gave me to see things in this wicked world for what they truly are. So you don't have to listen to me, but I advise you to believe what God is warning of and examine your own life by that standard. God bless you and Shalom.